就很快很快走路啊，所以没有时间帮你们。但是在台湾不要危险，来不要担心。Actually quite fine so far. I didn't have any problems. In other countries, it was more difficult. Where are you from, and how long have you been here? Okay, uh, so I'm from France, and I've been in Taiwan for like one semester, so half a year. One semester. Yes. So I guess you're a student. Yeah, I was studying in Shijian Da Xue. Oh. Yes. So you can Taipei. speak Mandarin. Yeah, 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 yeah. I learned uh, Chinese back in France for yeah. four years. Okay. And so I came back to Taiwan to just improve my Chinese and get to know a bit more like the culture, and. Like also because I'm a big tea lover, and yeah. as Taiwan has like one of the best like you know Olong teas, yeah. I was like, okay, when I'm coming here to understand more like the production yeah. and to get to know more like the Taiwanese like yeah. tea. I'm from Germany and I arrived two days ago in Taiwan. I'm from uh, the U.S., Colorado, yeah. and I've been here for about a month now. So what is like traveling to Taiwan with zero Mandarin? I can't read anything, and it's frustrating. But you know. That's my fault. That's on me, and I feel also like I'm missing out on most of the experience because maybe it's just me, but I'm sure everyone knows the stereotype of the ugly American. You just go someplace and you start talking English at the locals, and that's okay if they don't understand. You just talk louder and make lots of movements. You know, get in their face. What could go wrong with that? So no, trying not to be that guy. I feel like I haven't been able to really engage with the locals as much as I like, and I think that's the biggest thing that's missing. I've been traveling a lot around like Asia, and I think like Taiwan is the most that the people are more more friendly than anywhere. In terms of language. In terms of language, no, I mean like just in general, like in they general. are super friendly. Yeah. Like. Yeah, if you don't speak the language, they will like try to speak in you with you like in English or with, like Google Translate. Yeah. Even like the ama agon, you know, the yeah. grandfathers oh, okay, and okay. like. So you can speak Taiwanese. Oh uh, no, <laughs> very bad. Oh, okay. But yeah, like everyone is trying to like help you in it. Yeah. In a way, so and like I didn't find this in some Asian countries, yeah. and I think like. In Taiwan, you always like feel at home. Yeah. Yeah, there is always someone to help you. So. Okay. Okay. We can speak Chinese. Okay. Okay. For example, like I go to France, like I know, if I don't speak Chinese, some people will ignore me. Ah, in in I really in France, because many people don't speak English, so they don't have time to help you. Okay. 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 大家会帮助你吗 ？Yeah. Okay. Okay. 你可以过大哥。呃、uh, ，He's the boss. Yeah. It's actually quite fine so far. I didn't have any problems. In other countries, it was more difficult. Like I've also been to South Korea or uh, Hong Kong was quite good. China was also not really good in English. But here so far, especially the younger people can speak yeah. English quite well. So it's not really a problem so far. And also, I try to communicate with my hands if it doesn't work. Uh, like I like body language. Yeah, Google yeah. Translator is also okay. Also yeah. helps a lot. You can take pictures and translate it. Today's video, actually, I have a sponsorship. Yeah. So maybe you could help me to test this translator earbud. Yeah. Just for one minute, we can practice your Mandarin a little bit. Okay, okay. cool. Okay. Because I cannot speak German, yeah. so I would think that would be fun. Yeah. yeah okay. That's it. I haven't spoken German for a long while, yeah. actually. But German is your first language. Yeah. It's okay. My, it's that would be that would be awesome. Kommst du ursprünglich aus Taipei? Und was machst du hier? Ah, okay. Und ich habe von dir erfahren, dass du YouTube-Videos machst. Was machst du so hauptsächlich als dein Content? Ich drehe und filme hauptsächlich Straßen. Ich drehe hauptsächlich Straßeninterviews und übe dann Englisch. Ah, sehr interessant. Okay, so you 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 think it's like uh, pretty accurate? Yeah, it's actually really accurate. Oh, uh, okay. I mean, if we can, I can uh, read it, and also the German was exactly what I said. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah because I can ask the Vicky Tor. Yeah, I don't know <laughs> German, so Mandarin, how yeah, it was accurate for you, but yeah, you gave the right answer, so. Okay, I guess so, so yeah, American English, right? Mm -hmm. uh, I always speak Mandarin. Okay. okay. 你会去台湾其他城市玩吗 
I'm planning to visit uh, Hualien. I'm not sure where else I want to go. I don't want to rush. Have you ever heard Taiwanese music? I don't think so, but I just got a CD at the night market the other day. Do you think this translation is accurate? Well, we're certainly having a conversation with no problems. I think it works. If I don't speak English, I should be able to communicate. Yeah, I think so. We could probably do it like this uh, forever. How did you know uh, about Taiwan? Or is anyone influenced you to, to visit Taiwan? Uh, so, I think my primary influence has probably been time. So, of course, uh, it's, it seems like it's controversial whether uh, it's indigenous Taiwanese or it's uh, Chinese imported. But whatever it is, uh, if I wanted to see the real China and not the panopticon that Winnie the Pooh has created over in the mainland, I needed to uh, come see it while well, I still can. And this seems like the real China, what the mainland should be. Well, that, that is a very interesting idea. So, like, why did you want to know about real China? So, uh, did you study that or...? Well, I mean, there's like three civilizations that started and everything came from that. There's the Greeks, there's the Mesopotamians, and there's China. And that's been reduced down to East versus West. Obviously, uh, you want to understand how the other half is, so you have to at least try to make an attempt to understand China and all the rich culture and history and all of that. So have you ever been to China before? Uh, so. If we're talking about the mainland, PRC, uh, no, I haven't. And I don't think I really ever want to go. But if we're talking about here, uh, Republic of China or Taiwan or yeah. Formosa or whatever yeah. you call it, this is my first time. And hopefully if things stay peaceful, I'd definitely like to come back. Today I 俄文跟西伯拉文都非常好所以我想试试看如果我不会讲那个西伯拉文跟俄文的情况下我们能不能够顺利的沟通 Привет, как дела? 我很好 Что ты вчера делал? <笑> 我昨天去海边 啊,玩水。對,對,對,還有是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是是
那它的包装其实非常漂亮啊。那要使用时空壶呢，翻译耳机的话呢，你需要下载他们家的 app。那我现在啊、呃、操作给大家看一下，您就需要先把这个耳机拿上来呢。OK， 我们右耳连接，我们左耳也把它靠近。OK， 你就可以看到两左左右耳百分之百的电量呢都已经连接了，都已经连接上来了。那这个时候它最棒的就是它有各种不同的模式啊。那我在影片中里面示范呢两种最常用的模式呢，第一个呢就是所谓的外放模式。那外放模式呢，就是非常适用呢。如果将来你在旅游的时候啊，你在问路啊，啊、呃，或者买东西啊，我觉得在旅游的时候是非常容易做使用的。那么还有一个就是在我影片后半段呢，我跟我朋友 Rita 聊天的时候呢，那就是属属于这个同传模式。它这个呢，就是属于呢，呃，这个模式呢就非常适合呢。如果说你有一些呃不同国家的朋友啊，或或者是说不同国籍的这个婚姻啊，还有我觉得很棒是，如果说你有些国际会议的时候呢，你可以请对方呢。或者说对方的家人啊、呃，一人带上一只耳机，那你们可以做一些比较深度的一些交流。因为耳机呢，它是属于私人物品嘛。那如果说你会介意跟别人使用啊，或者说对方他会也会介意这个卫生问题的话，那我就会建议呢，你在沟通的时候呢，可以使用呃外放的模式，就是我前面呢在做街访的影片的所使用的模式。那如果对方不介意卫生的习惯呢、啊，那你也不介意的话，那当然你可以呃使用第二种模式，双方呢都一起使用耳机。那基本上就是看你个人的需求是如何。那如果你们有需要这个产品的话，你们可以到影片下方呢。呃，有我专属的折扣码呢，你可以用它的链接去购买。那如果有任何的问题呢，也都可以欢迎留言告诉我。那 OK， see you guys。如果你也想成为下一位爆红创作者，请打开下方资讯栏链接，一起来投稿吧。